Now, I have an unboxing that I want to do for a uh, Unicorn Overlord, the Monarch Edition. I did buy the PS5 version, and you know, this did came in the mail yesterday. Now, before I want to open this, I want to show you one game that I got for for a few days ago, and from eBay, I managed to get a I managed to get Gravity Rush, the PS Vita version. Now, I had to get this. I had to get this on eBay though, since they did come with the offer that I had to get. So I had to get. I had to pick this up. This did cost me a lot during the aftermarket, but I had to get it though, since you know this is a sealed copy, as you can tell by the way it looks. And you know, I'm very happy to get the PS Vita version. I did have the PS4 version of the remastered edition, but I had to get this one though, since this is actually original where it came from, just like Uncharted, The Golden Abyss though. So yeah, I'm very happy to get my sealed copy of Gravity Rush. I might buy more of the PS Vita games later on though. So yeah, now onto the unboxing of Unicorn Over overlord the monarch edition so i want to show you guys one more time now i had to buy i had to buy this one though since it's not only on sale but it actually had a pretty good price not only it's on sale but it came here on time though and i had a good offer in it as well though so i'm gonna crack it open to see what's inside and i did play the demo version a little bit though and i was really impressed with the amount of combat skill and the amount of uh, customizations you could do here and the uh, traversal traversal in this one so i'm really interested to see how how this plays out and this is actually made by uh, as you can see atlas as usual though since this is actually like one of the smallest companies that now officially owns by sega though so yeah i'm gonna open this one a slide here i had to get the ps5 version though since this is like because as you can see on the package it looks so it looks more fragrant though so yeah here's the here's the unique unboxing around here around here a lot of the, the really cool package though so let me read this again it comes with the outer box uh the art book the card game and the 16-bit uh arranged music album though so yeah this is another this is a really unique fancy unboxing though so and here's the physical game itself which i'm gonna crack it open though so this is the ps5 edition though so you know i had to, i had to get this version though since it's a really since this is actually fits the colors pretty well and uh you know let me see around here there's a lot of dlc codes which i'm not going to show here's the physical game in here and just so you know today is a uh, saturday uh it's actually it's saturday it's pretty late in the morning right now so i'll be making this video a bit quicker though so yeah Here's the arranged music though, which I really do like this packaging a little bit, even though it looks kind of like a like a booklet though, but that's okay. So you know. Here's the soundtrack though, so uh, you know, really good looking looking on the artwork. I really do like the 16-bit uh bit art cover though so here's what it looks like in here and i'm gonna crack it open right here so yeah there are two color version here's the here's the song sheet or i should say the the title sheet though so very happy to get this one here's the art book around here it's a bit disappointing but you know i do prefer more of the uh, hardcover one but this one i'm okay with though since there's it's not that big and here's the uh Is there anything in here uh nope that should be fine so here's the uh, card game around here uh pretty basic stuff so i want to see what's inside Ooh. yeah it comes with a lot of things uh you know some tabletops and some instruction booklet around here a full book here's the uh bag of dice as you can see uh let me check i'll hope i won't lose it though so The amount of dice so that's pretty cool um you know you know i might buy more um atlas games i've heard that metaphors coming out and you guys might have seen the game the summer game fest a couple a couple hours ago um you know you know the game fest though so there's a lot of games i'm more excited for probably this year um uh, probably this year i might buy the uh, collector's edition for alan wake 2 i don't know if i could buy one though since if it's limited run i really can't buy it though so yeah now on to 
onto something what's inside. Here's all the cards. And you know, I'm not gonna show this off as much since there's so many of them. So um, there's a lot of cool things in there though. So yeah, I mean, this is quite a bit of a unique co collector's edition I got, the Monarch edition. A um, lot of stuff in there though. So uh, this is a bit of a shorter video on how to make yet again, but you know how to do it though, since this is a bit, this was pretty late on me. So yeah, I did bought this pretty late. This did came out a few weeks ago or like a month, right? Month and a half right now though. So, so that's pretty much everything what I want to unbox now. I wish I want to show you guys everything, but I don't want to fiddle around too much since there's so much shit that I don't want to lose though. So yeah. Now, um, what do you guys think though? Let me know in the comments below. Like, fair, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, call me your questions. Uh, I'll be doing more, uh, I'll be doing more unboxings like this later on. Uh, I might, uh, let me know in the comments below. Do you want me to do a live stream or not? Or who knows? I mean, there are times I want to do a live stream, but I'm not so sure though, since the, the technical issues and the complications. So, yeah. Um, anyway, that's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time. Until then, peace the fuck out.